prophets come and try It don't matter where we be at When you see us, we gon' ride We'll pull up where you be at Hit the streets and bring it out Plus we practice what we preach And read them scriptures, then apply You wanna pull up on the prophets Come and try It don't matter where we be at When you see us, we gon' ride We'll pull up where you be at Hit the streets and bring it out The things that we've been taught lies That we have been taught lies That we have to come back to the truth To the knowledge of who we are a part of that knowledge is knowing our history, right? The history that before Black Month, the shortest month of the year, right? They laugh at it for us, right? Did this happen? Did this happen to our people? Uh, you don't think this happened to our people? This debate, well, yeah, but not on the scale that they told us. Okay, do you, did it happen harder or lesser than, than how they tell us? Well, no, the, the suffering was real, but I don't think, like, the number that they said they brought over here, that, I don't think that happened. You think it was more or less? Way less. Way less people? Mm -hmm. Flip the sign around, Jedediah. So were the sl were so-called blacks only brought to... The Americas? Were they only brought to North America? No. You, you see this sign? You see where they took us from parts of, parts of Africa? And they took us all across, Right? They took us all across to the Americas, Central America, South America. Most of us were brought as slaves to Brazil. Do you understand that? Give me Isaiah 65 and 15. So most of us, and then Deuteronomy 4. You understand? So we were brought as slaves, but they're not going to teach us this in the Bible. They're going to they're teach us slaves obey your masters. They're going to teach us that oh, all you was was slaves. We saved you. From the from the coast of Africa, because you you was uh, over there acting like monkeys and Savage. savages, right? This is the history that they teach us. This is their history, but they don't teach us the true history of the Bible. Right? We're gonna bring it out. Read Isaiah chapter sixty-five, verse fifteen. And ye shall you leave your name for a curse. So, as a byproduct of what would happen to us through that transatlantic slave trade, through the sub-Saharan slave trade, before that, right? Throughout all of our captivities that we've gone through, read. And ye shall leave your name for a curse. At the end of the day, we left our name for a curse. We now call ourselves black man. We stand up proud for that thing too. We call ourselves a uh, Native American man, right? Mexican man, Puerto Rican man. And we think those are, those are our names, but they're not, right? Read. Unto my chosen, for the Lord God shall slay thee and call his servant. So God was going to do what? Slay thee and call his servants by another name. So God slayed us and called his servants by another name. Another name is African American, black man. These, this is another name. This is not our God-given name. So what we are here to do is teach history, teach heritage, teach our culture, teach the purpose of why we've gone through slavery and the solution to get out of it. This is, the, this is what our people need. We need the solutions in our communities. So our little boys will stop shooting each other. So our little girls will stop whoring themselves out. Do you understand? Read. Deuteronomy chapter 4 verse 27. And the Lord shall scatter you among the nations. So the Lord did what? Scatter you among the nations. Did, did all nations, were all nations, were all people scattered throughout the nations? Were all, were, was all nations, were they scattered throughout every other nation? Or was there one group of people that was scattered, transported throughout the nations? Yeah. Read Deuteronomy 101. Let's see who the Bible says that this is talking about. Deuteronomy chapter 1 verse 1. On. These be the words which Moses spake unto all Israel. You, you heard of Moses, right? Yeah. Moses said he just spake these words unto who? All Israel. Unto the Israelites. You so-called blacks, Hispanics, and Native Americans. Read. On this side, Jordan, in the wilderness. So he, he was only speaking to one group of people. Go back to 4 and 27. Let's see what would happen to this one group of people. Deuteronomy 4, verse 27. And the Lord shall scatter you among the nation. So as a, as a result of our disobedience, we were scattered among the nations. We're teaching black history in the Bible. That's all we're doing. Shalom Israel, this is Bishop Nathaniel. I want you to know that you can view all our Sabbath classes live
on IUIC TV. That's right, I said on IUIC TV. Download the app today. Shalom. We used to scream black power while Heron was pushed. But at the end of the day, nothing's in vain. IUIC has been given a vision. The tents of Judah has risen. Many has attempted the mission. Minor murmuring, omitting, and missing the mark. Just reading that he had the flame of fire in his eyes gave us the spark. We on Paul's mission. We out on the road, purple and gold. From Mexico, Cuba, Haiti, Ghana, Sierra Leone. 144,000 boots banging, concrete crackling. These are how our men repented at heart. The scriptures is proof. IUIC, we deliver the truth.